this is uh, the second uh, partition algorithm here called Hure. Uh, basically the same thing with the Lomoto which is the goal is to uh, obtain the P fiber of partition split into that and do the, the rest of the procedure if you notice here uh, basically here the same the fiber here is uh, based on a l l equal to zero which is if you are taking the same example is actually two p equal to two and uh, i equal to l l zero j equal to r plus one so here we have two uh, direction mean from i and j i actually is a repetition from i i start with one until uh, this a i greater than or equal to p and the second condition, a uh, second uh, side is uh, j, j equal to j minus 1. So, i is increased, j minus uh, decrease until a, j less than equal to p. Meaning that we have the both sides from the i and from the j. And it will cross basically until a certain point that called crossover. So, after that, there is a swap here. So, this is actually the swap. If you notice that we have 1, 2 and 3 swap function here so the issue is what is the logic here the swap here and swap here especially for this uh, uh, the swap here indicated that uh, through that comment here undo the last swap it's, uh, why do we need to this uh, to undo this so if we trace this uh, understand the process using the set, uh, example here then we may appreciate that the idea from this uh, hurry okay so here the repeat here means I equal to 1 until ai greater than mean the repeat here until this true when false when it is false it will continue here the same when until this j true which is actually j a j whatever value for j here less than equal to p and after that when this true and this uh, true true and after that the swap here and there is another repeat here outer loop here which is actually the constant i greater than equal to j where i and j actually both direction will cross and i become greater than or equal to j we stop here and after that the second swap will take place and before the third swap here after that, you return j which is the partition below uh, in quick sort which is s and s we split that the partition into the first half array the second half array so this is the concept option Okay, we continue to understand the Hori uh, partition algorithm based on the uh, example that we used uh, previously for the others algorithm, uh, especially for the Lumoto. Okay, if you notice just now, we have two direction, both direction I because from the dash move onto the right, J from the right minus move onto the re reduce to the I. So, until certain condition here, when I less than J, when there is called crossover, I and J crossover, I uh, actually uh, greater than, sorry, here is actually the greater or equal to J. Greater or equal to J. Okay. And we cross over and after that we do the swap here. And there are three swap here. Swap, for the swap actually in the loop and after that, uh, we have a two swap uh, function here after the loop so this swap called the undo swap actually to the last uh, swap uh, undo the last swap when i greater than equal to j so what is the logic behind it so you have to trace this and after that go through all the process or procedure from this hooray then we can appreciate this why actually we need it is needed here okay Okay, first is uh, for here, uh, the P is actually uh, the candidate of fiber here, or partition is 2. So, this P equal 2. So, start with I equal to 1 here, this 8. So, 8 greater than 2 and true. So, now true here. So, this true, I equal to 1 here. And the true is stop because that condition is uh, repeat i equal to i plus 1 until a i greater than or equal to p right? meaning that repeat until true when false still uh, continue and here then we uh, next is for the j g equal to j minus 1 um, 
R plus 1 6 6 minus 1 5 start with 5 here 5 less than 2 and J now equal to 5 ok uh, still false uh, reduce for uh, the value is 3 less than 2 false uh, reduce by 1 3 in that 3 let's see is 10 uh, less than 2 false and after that in that 2 2 is 1 1 less then or equal to 2 this actually true so the the latest index is now is 2i is uh, 1 so once this true stop and the net is swap swap a i i is 1 here 1 is uh, 1 is 8 here j is 2 j is 2 is 1 here so we need to swap here with a 8 and one here okay so the latest uh, re, uh list here two one eight ten three five okay net is continue again now the net is our uh, now the i become two two is uh eight here eight greater than two uh true and go to this uh, now two increase by one here so 1 is uh, 1 less than 2 ok less than 2 also true here and but also this condition I you see now uh, 2 less than 1 and after that we have to do this uh, swap here so this become um, uh, I is what is the value of I is 2 2 2 is actually 8 and uh, the value of uh, J is 1 so swap again so we come uh, this 8 and this 1 ok and after that is uh, here undo the undo why need undo and when we swap this, uh, this become AI. AI is a uh, 2. Uh, sorry, AI 2. AJ is 1. 2 and 1. So, this is the second, uh, third swapping. 1 and 8 here. So, the, the latest uh, uh, update the array. 1, 2, 1, 8. 10, 3, 5. This is actually the latest. Okay. After this swap. And next is to swap here. AL. AL is 0. AJ is 1. So this here. This are uh, 0, 1. So we, we have to swap here. AL is 0, is 2. The fiber with the 1 here. So now we swap here. 1 with the 2 here this become 1 okay so according to this we finish this this become actually the latest array uh, the list here is 1 2 8 10 3 and 5 here and the pi, uh, the candidate just now the, the fiber is when change the position this actually the partition P now we have uh, two sub arrays split into this which is actually the, this is the first array, this is the second array, okay? And after that, do the same with the, this is the fiber, but here is, according to the uh, quick sort, the condensation must be L less than R, but now L and R basically is false, then we can stop here and do the rest of this, uh, the second sub array, 8, 10, 3, 5, with the same with the fiber here. Okay, this is a concept of the uh, sorting introduced by Hure uh, I mean from the both side from the I increase from the J decrease and when uh, crossover happen you swap and some uh, redo here and after that the last swap actually to get the final fiber value where this become the S which is the partition value to split the array into sub array okay and back to the condition on the quick sort L less than R. If L still less than R, then do the recursive until uh, the condition is possible.